At some point in your life, you'll ask yourself one of the most important questions that can be asked. Am I a gamer? Well, to answer this question, first we have to answer the question, what is a gamer? Easy. Let's just take a look at the dictionary. A player who is game. What? What does that even mean? Oh, here we go. An athlete. <laughs> okay, no. So the dictionary is wrong. Well, let's just look back in time. In the early ages of video games, most people would think of gamers as little kids, or if you were an adult gamer, you were some type of weak nerdy guy. But obviously, that can't be right, because I'm a gamer, and this is me. Okay, but then in the 2000s, the perception of what a gamer was turned into this guy. Again, wrong. Oh, here we go. For a brief moment in the late 2000s, you were only a gamer if you were Gerard Butler, as you can see from this movie poster for Gamer 2009. And by God, you don't want to see what happens when you unleash a gamer. I've got you. And then for a while, gaming became more socially accepted, and it seemed like anyone who played video games could be a gamer. Anyone can be a gamer, even if it's like doing a Sudoku on your phone. Wait, that's not a video game. How is that? Wait, not everyone's a gamer, because this is what a gamer looks like but I've gamed for more than 20 years now. Nintendo showed us you're only a gamer if you play Nintendo Switch on the rooftops of buildings. Why would I game on the roof? No, now you're only a gamer if you eat Takis. Jesus, this is confusing. I think we can all just agree that if you play video games and want to be a gamer, you're a gamer, no matter what you look like. Psych, <laughs> you idiot. <laughs> Did you know that according to the EA executive, L. McCarthy, there's really no such thing as gamers. So gamers like you and I, we simply do not exist.